Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Lisa and in today's video, I'm gonna show you my most recent Monica Vinader haul and I'm gonna give you guys a proper review on the stuff that I got. I actually wanted to do the unboxing in my Coachella vlog, but a lot of the vlog was corrupted um, because of water damage. So I only had whatever I uploaded before the rest of the stuff got corrupted. Anyway, I'm going to show you guys the unboxing portion. When I was at Coachella, you guys can see how much I just like love the product from the beginning but I'm gonna give you guys also an extensive review so without further ado let's jump to the haul item number one we have this huge heart pendant this is so cute it comes with a long chain please tell me I got a long chain cuz oh my gosh is this the chain please tell me yes next item we have this silver ring it's super cute I actually haven't decided if I'm going silver or gold today, so TBD. Next is this bracelet. It's a pearl bracelet with their iconic chain. I love this because even when you live alone, it's just so easy to put on. I guess that decides that I think I'm gonna go with gold today just because this is also gold and the pendant is gold and it's perfect because our outfits today are dedicated to the headliner today, which is Lana Del Rey. This one is a chain with hearts all over. I am so so obsessed. I'm gonna wear this immediately. Look at this. I wanna see. Oh, that's so cute. This is yeah. so cute. This is what these two look like together. Wow. That is so cute. Okay, jewelry is set for the day. Perfect. The last item are these earrings. I won't be wearing them today, but these ones are part of their new collection. And this one's super edgy. I'm gonna save it for one of the nights when I'm going for a silver theme. There's also a link in my bio for 20% off. And if you guys wanna check out my entire collection with Monica Vinader, you can go to lisaway.com slash Monica Vinader. But I love their jewelry. I always take them on vacation and it's just chef's kiss. As you guys can see, the pieces that I got from that recent haul were these two right here. So the heart necklace here and also the locket. It's funny because I genuinely forgot this was a locket. Like I honestly just liked the heart shape, but as you guys can see, it's a really cute locket. I also feel like I didn't really grow up with my mom or my grandmother using lockets. I feel like it's a more westernized thing. If you guys didn't know, I actually was born in Taiwan and obviously my ancestors are all from Taiwan, but it's not like a common thing in like Asian jewelry, I would say. It's more definitely westernized. I'm gonna be putting in some pictures, but I'm just kind of like, what kind of picture would I put in a locket? And honestly, I feel like I would put a spicy picture because like in today's day and age, you have your phone, which you can access your photos. You can literally have a Polaroid. You can even go back and have film. So it's like, if you really want a locket and it's giving this like hush hush a secret vibe it's got to be a spicy picture and i feel like not enough people take advantage of that so i mean right now it isn't obviously because well first of all i just remembered that this is a locket but second this is also an ad this is already as you guys can see like not easy to open it's meant to be a secret okay i'm pretty sure the history of lockets is like your secret lover or your lover or like whatever it is. And I just don't think that this picture is supposed to be like a regular picture. Like I think we need to be using it correctly. Back to the actual review. Okay, so if you guys are coming to this video because you guys wanted to hear the review of either Monica Vinader as a jewelry brand or even just some of the pieces that I have worn this month and have loved, this is my essential review. If you guys are new to Monica Vinader, one of the things that I would say that makes Monica Vinader different from other brands is number one, in terms of style, I personally really like to wear my Monica Vinader jewelry when I'm on vacation especially if I'm traveling or if I have a lot of statement pieces. I'm not saying they're not good for every day. They definitely are. But when I'm like really trying to find standout pieces for when I'm going to like a formal event, when I'm on vacation, they just have the best selection for that. And Coachella was also that for sure. I feel like I was wearing this locket. I got a lot of compliments on it and people asking me where I got my jewelry from. I just absolutely love the design of their jewelry. The other thing I wear will say about Monica Vinader is that even though they are gold vermeil and has held up, I've also noticed that all of the pieces, these are all Monica Vinader by the way, and even this jewelry box which I have my name engraved. I just absolutely love. I just like travel with this jewelry case. I could literally leave my pieces 
in here for a really long time and none of the pieces will tarnish. This is such a huge plus because I feel like some other brands when it comes to gold vermeil, it kind of just like tarnishes if you don't wear them or they don't hold up as nicely. I feel like the quality of these pieces honestly really stand on its own. So specifically for my haul this time, as you guys know, I got these two pieces. I actually wanted to test out this necklace because I noticed that th this also comes in a bracelet form. If you guys didn't know, I absolutely love their bracelets because more specifically, because they're super easy to take off. And this is like a gold chain through and through. It just looks so good with your outfits, especially with it dangling. So I honestly just really, really like the look of them. This particular design comes in the bracelet. So I wanted to test out the necklace first to see if I really like it. And I've been getting so many compliments on this. It just has these like little hearts all around and I absolutely love it. I think it's so cute. I'm going to be getting the bracelet next. I think it's going to be on my wish list. I also got a new pearl piece and as usual, as expected, they have nailed, they have nailed this piece. Look at how beautiful this is. I've been wearing it all month and I love the design of this pearl. It just makes my bracelet stand out. And even if you look at the chain of this piece, it is so dainty, so easy to take on and off if you want to. And at the same time, it makes this dangly piece look really stylish. I just feel like even when I'm doing my own thing, it just like makes it look really, really cute. And it just has these like, gold bangles that are kind of like dangling from my wrist. I don't know, I just like love the feel of them and obviously the look of them as well. The other two pieces that I got were, this one is a new piece that I got. This is their silver one. This does come in the gold option. I do love this design. What is also unique to Monica Vinader is that she really focuses on design. She also designs the pieces. It's not just like a straight line in a band. Like, you know what I mean? There is art to each piece. So even with each piece, I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's like little, little curvatures. It's not just like straight, there's little designs through and through. Like there's a lot of thought that has been put in this ring, even though from the looks of it, it just looks kind of basic, but it isn't like up close and personal. It is genuinely a piece of art. Same with these earrings. These earrings are just really nicely textured and they're all around just very artistic. I think for those people who like really appreciate art, I think this is definitely the jewelry brand for you because all their pieces are super unique. You can obviously wear it like this where the jewelry kind of like curves towards your ear. You can also wear it from the other perspective where it looks more like a wing, if you will. Personally, I've been enjoying wearing it like this. I kind of like when the V goes out like so, but I honestly think it looks cute regardless. I love and appreciate how the art and the quality really is such a good hybrid. Like it's not compromising either or. So anyway, if you guys want to check out some of their jewelry pieces, I highly recommend. If you want to take inspo on the collection that I have, make sure you check out my website. I have every single item listed, but some recommendations if you guys want me to provide any. Um, my favorite are definitely their bracelets. So definitely the pearl pieces. This one, any of their pearl stuff is my favorite. I wore this one all of last month. I love them. My mom wanted to borrow these, but I was like, I'm going to need these. So not yet. This is probably my favorite favorite necklace by them. I have them in both silver and gold, but this chain necklace, which also comes in a bracelet, is chef's kiss for me. If you guys have not checked out the brand, make sure you guys do. They are a UK-based brand, and it is a brand that I've been starting to wear since a year ago, and I'm just absolutely in love with them. I have previous videos as well. Make sure you take a look at those if you want other inspo, but if you guys have any other questions about either the brand or some of the pieces that I wore, make sure you ask below and I'm very happy to answer them. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!